Hey guys, uh, Chris back here again. We've got another quick video here for you guys. This will be dealing with your uh, AK style rivals, the uh, 7.62 by uh, 39 caliber specifically for that. Got another quick review here for the uh, magazines. You got a Magpul uh, Gen 3 uh, P Mag here, made by Magpul. Here's the uh, information on the outside of the packaging right here, made by Magpul. P Mag Gen 3 AK AKM 7.62 by 39 caliber here. Here's the information on the actual tag. Magpul Gen 3. It's all the good information plus the I tier stuff you can't export it. And Magpul Industries down there as well too. So that's the front portion of the packaging. Back portion of the packaging just plain gray on here. And then you got down here is the uh, designation down here plus a uh, barcode on here as well, well plus the actual uh, part number right here which is right there as well too for that for reference point the uh, gen 3 p mag for the 8k uh, rifle right here as well too so we'll take it out of the packaging show you what it looks like here and you can see what the information or i should say see what the part looks like specifically for that so let's get it out of here okay there we go set that aside get the packaging set it over here okay it looks good so here's your good old uh, P Mag made by Magpul. This is their uh, version of the AK uh, 47 or AKM style magazine right here for reference. Good old P Mag. You have uh, reinforcement locking lugs in the back. You got one in the back right here. You got one in the front. So the uh, front area is reinforced. You also have a reinforcements along the uh, front, I call it like a front spine area right here for that, so you have reinforcements along that front area. And that's what the butt magazine body looks like over here. I've got the uh, designation right here. PMAG right here in the front, Let me just wiped off here. PMAG right on there, PMAG 38K Magpul Industries Corp. Cage code, made in the United States. So that's what the uh, magazine body looks like for reference right here. Plus you also have like a dot matrix down here for indentation down there as well too plus you know here's here's the uh, spine area looks like you got the reinforcements up here in the back and there's your spine area it has like nice gripping surfaces right here for uh, texture and here's your other side of the magazine right here as well too for reference points you got your uh, dot matrix and get some oil down here dot matrix stuff right down here and up in the front area right here got your caliber designation right here 7.60 by 39 Gen 3 Z and has a patent pending made by Magpul and Industries right there as well too so that's what the magazine looks like externally right there for you guys so let me get a better shot here seeing so see it on a better angle maybe a better light but uh, that's what the magazine looks like and our side shot right here and the front spine area There you go. The other side, the right side. There you go. And the back side again as well too. And here's your uh, floor plate faller or the uh, called I'm just called the foot down here. That's what the uh, uh, floor plate looks like down here for the uh, bottom cover of the magazine body down here. Go ahead and roll that around here again. Hold on, guys. Be a better side shot here. There you go. There's the Magpul logo. So it looks good. Show you the feed lip area right here as well, too. There's your feed lip area right here for the uh, magazine. Looks good. So that's what the magazine looks like in its uh, assembled state. Here's your logo for the uh, Gen 3. And there's your other side logo, PMAG. And we'll go ahead and take this thing apart and see what the inside gut look, guts look like, guys. So 
stay with me here for a couple minutes and we'll do the internal inspection as well too guys so i'll see you